I guess I thought that the grasshopper's legs would get like caught in my throat as I ate them, but no, they go down pretty smooth. So I don't talk about it too much on this channel, but I am a huge baseball fan. It's actually a goal of mine to visit all 30 Major League stadiums, and I've been to 19 of them so far. But I've been stuck at 19 for a while now. I just haven't had a chance to visit any new ones the past few years. But just because I can't visit all 30 stadiums, doesn't mean I can't eat something from each of them. That is where the MLB Food Fest comes in. See, the MLB Food Fest is a collection of specialty items from each of the 30 Major League ballparks. But these ain't your grandfather's ballpark foods. They have the old standby, sure, but they also have some weird stuff like toasted grasshoppers from Seattle and Rocky Mountain oysters from Colorado. You know what those are, right? Yeah, but first things first, time to get in uniform. Perfect. I'm on a bit of a time crunch here. I only have two hours, which is about four minutes per item, so time is of the essence. I'm going straight to the weird stuff. Where are those grasshoppers? Can I get some grasshoppers, please? I mean, they're not great, if I'm being honest. They're not gross. All right, I think I need a bit of a palate cleanser after those grasshoppers. Hi, you got a churro dog? This is all dessert, right? This is legit one of the best things I've ever had in my life. Palate is cleansed. Gotta get those Rocky Mountain oysters now. Hi, it says cowboy caviar. That is full. That's right. And the sign they called it cowboy caviar as if we're not gonna know the difference, but gotta try it. Kind of chewy. Yeah, this is pretty foul. This is not the first time I've eaten testicles though. Years ago, me and my friend Vinny pictured here eating a giant novelty Reese's Pieces, did something called the Great Urban Race. It was like a scavenger hunt type thing, and one of the challenges was to eat a raw duck testicle, and Vinny didn't really want to do it, so I stepped up to the plate and I ate a raw duck testicle. Sometimes you just gotta be a champion and eat a duck ball. Okay, there is a ton of food here, and time is short. I'm gonna have to montage through some of this. Remember when I said the churro dog was the best thing I ever had? Yeah, I take it back. The Wisconsin cheese fries are the best thing I've ever had. Fatigue is starting to set in. I think I'm coming down with the meat sweats. This Frito Pied Corn Dog, one bite of it weighs like three pounds. It has the density of a dying star. Is it normal for your left arm to be hurting like this? I don't think it is. It was worth it.